fast food tier list. Uh, as you can see on the screen right here, the fast food tier list. So we're gonna be rating it from D to S on the scale. So first we'll start out with Arby's. I'm gonna have to put Arby's at a good C because the food isn't consistent, but they they have some good things, some bad. Uh, Burger King, we're gonna have to give that a D because they just ruin everything. So yeah, we'll go with them later. Uh, with Carl's Jr., I've never had that. Uh, I don't I don't know what, how it is because I've never had Carl's Jr. before, but. Alright, so we got Burger King and Arby's at D, and Carl Jr., I've never had that, so if I've never had anything, I'm not going to try and rate it, but we're going to go with, uh, this is hard, Chipotle, I don't know where I should put the Chipotle at, um, I'm going to put Chipotle at, I'm going to give it, I'm going to give it, because I'm not a huge Mexican guy, but some people are, so I mean, I'm mean, i gonna all get hate for that. Domino's, I'll give that a, hmm. Domino's, I'll give that an A. DQ, I mean, most of their stuff is crap. All, uh, if you don't go there for your ice cream, I don't know what you've been smoking because the only DQs around here are right next to other restaurants like Chipotle, Buffalo Wings and Rings. So if you're gonna go out, just spend an extra $10 and get something good. Um, next, we Five Guys. Uh, I'm gonna have to give Five Guys the highest rating because I've never had a bad experience there. Some people do. I've never had a bad experience there, but uh, it's good food. In and out, I've never had In and Out. Uh, Chick Fil A, because I mean, In and Out, we it's like a West Coast kind of thing. So I mean, I haven't had West Coast because I've not really been on there. Uh, B, we're gonna put Little Caesars, not at B. I'm gonna go down to Little Caesars because Little Caesars, I've never really had a great experience there because everything just tastes so frozen. It's not good. Uh, Jack in the Box, I've heard that's terrible. I've never had that though, so I can't personally rate that. Uh, Chick-fil-A, All most of these things I've never had before. KFC, I've had KFC. I've not had a good experience with KFC. But we're gonna have to give that a C. It's all right. Uh, their fried chicken's good, I guess. Their biscuits are good. But it just makes you feel terrible after it. Just, I mean, McDonald's, that is basically the place where you can have a good experience or a terrible one. So I'll give it a C because sometimes I get something there and it's really good. Sometimes I get something there and it's really bad. Uh, Panda Express, I'll give that a C. A lot of these things are just base fast food places. Not anything, not anything special, really. Uh, Papa John's will go up and give Papa John's a good rating at B because it's all right. It's, actually, no. Let's go to A with Domino's. But I think Papa John's is better than Domino's in certain categories. Uh, Pizza Hut, dang. They're like Pizzone. Yeah. I'll give that a, a B or C. Uh, Popeyes. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go move Popeyes off of the screen to S. This is good. Uh, Sonic, base, again, it's just like a base fast food restaurant. Nothing really special about it. Um, nothing really special, nothing really cool. It's kind of normal. Uh, in and out, so we got in it, Sonic. I'll try and rate these off of my knowledge, but I don't really have never really had these before. But yeah. This is my list. My fast food tier list. I'll give Chick-fil-A a good A in Sonic.